Hello and welcome to this edition of Tips and Tricks. Now today I'm going to be talking about the spot within the spot or the area within the area. Uh, as you know, this is my local pond. It's like two minutes from my house. I fish it all the time. Now I have a lot of other people here. I like to educate. That's why I do these videos. I've been teaching a lot of them how to bass fish because they're pretty new to it. And they often come to me and go, dude, you said you fished here and you, you caught seven yesterday and I've been in there for the next two days and I can't catch a thing. And it's sort of the fact that they don't know the spot within the spot. Uh, example, one of my friends, we have this area called the shallow area. And you go in there and it kind of splits and there's an, an open water to the left and there's an open water to the right and there's some reeds in front of you. And I've been going in there and catching sometimes five, six fish. I mean, mostly small ones, but fishing there. He's been going in there for the past week or so and he can never get a bite. And he said he can't figure out where I'm casting to catch it. Well, he's casting the open water to the right and the open water to the left. And I'm casting straight ahead against this little like 20 foot row of reeds. If I can cast it and get to hit right in front of those reeds and drop, that's when I almost always get a fish. If I cast and I, it lands three feet out and stinks down and I work it, nothing. It's the spot within the spot that they're all sitting. Now here it's a, it's a line of reeds, but I, on, a, on a long point or maybe a, a bluff wall or a stump field or weeds, there's always going to be something that's slightly different. There's always going to be a spot within a spot. Uh, maybe if it's weeds, it's a place where it's two feet deeper under. Or if it's on a point, it might be a place where there's, it, it's mostly just rock and go straight, but suddenly there's this little nook in it. But there's, there's always going to be a sweet spot within any spot. And when you find those, and a lot of times it's the angle, uh, that's where you can catch a fish. A lot of times other people will pull up on a point and fish it and they sometimes catch them that don't and you can almost pull up because you know the spot within the spot and load the boat. And trust me, one little spot could sometimes have 20, 30 fish on it. I mean it could only be you know five yards square. But that's where the fish are. It must be you know the bait are going over it or something, but they'll be very concentrated. I mean you can cast in there and catch fish after fish after fish. And fish the rest of the spot and not catch anything. So be sure when you're looking and you're out uh, and you have a spot and you catch a few, look for the spot within the spot. Because that's where you're going to catch most of your fish and probably your better fish. I hope this helps. Until next time.